Let's now add a rotation to our split squat. So to do this, we'll start with body weight and then you can add extra weight holding a dumbbell or kettlebell or a ball forward of your chest, which I'll show you in just a second. First, we need to get into our split stance. So you can do that from a standing position here and then step it back. But sometimes we don't know how far back our legs should go. So I actually prefer to come down here first to this half kneeling position, step my back leg back, just a little bit. So I have a straight line going from my knee to my hip all the way up through my torso and then drive through this front foot to stand. So either way, get into this position where they have a staggered stance. You have space widthwise between your feet. Hips are both pointing forward, not opening out to the side. Shoulders squared and back and down and core engaged. So from here, we'll lower down just like we would for a normal split squat. But when we get to the bottom with our back knee hovering off the floor, we're going to rotate. So rotate toward the side of your front leg, turning at a diagonal. We don't need to twist and go really far with this. We wanna keep this really controlled and strong. So rotate, this front knee will want to cave in. Keep pressing it out so that it stays aligned with the direction of your toes come back to center, drive through this front foot to stand up. Lower down, rotate, pressing that knee out, and come up. So with a dumbbell, you can hold it here, here, here. It can also be kettlebell or ball, right? We're going to lower down, rotate, come back to center, and up. When we do this exercise where everything is really sharp, we're going to do inhale down, exhale, rotate, inhale back to center, and exhale up. Once you get that down, if you'd like to make this a little smoother, you can lower down and rotate at the same time, inhale down, and then exhale up. Note that we are not rounding our back here to do this. We are not letting this shoulder come down at all. Everything is remaining very upright and stable as we move through. 